Welcome back, Talk Family, and thank you for joining me on another episode of Talk the Talk. I'm your host, Desh Palay Pechen, and joining me today is Paulette Van Staden, and she is the product specialist at Subaru Centurion. Now, Paulette's role as a product specialist is to support, improve, and manage the development of new and existing products. She is articulate and have good communication skills, and she also knows that having product knowledge is highly important and crucial to what she do in her job. Um, Paulette is also a nominee for the Motoring Woman of the Year Awards and she is going to the semi-finals. So I'm very, very pleased to be hosting yet another empowered woman in Motoring South Africa. So without further ado, let's welcome Paulette. And as always, this interview is proudly brought to you by Sariti Solutions, MFC and Evo by NetBank. Hello, Let. how are you? Well, thanks, how are you? I'm good, you know I'm good, let's not pretend. <laughs> let's we're, not doing, pretend we're, we're doing the hello because of our viewers. Okay. But, but yes, we had an amazing chat yeah. um, off air. You're such a, a beautiful person, not just outside, but inside as Thank well. You. All about woman empowerment, all about, you're so vibrant. So um, when anyone or any woman in the industry brings back or brings that to our table. It gives us hope that you are going to help us to pay this forward and empower more young girls. So Yay. thank you very much. Um, let's tell our viewers more about you okay. uh, and especially your journey in the trade. Okay, so my journey started when I was about 19, mm -hmm. going on 20, mm -hmm. so very young. Mm -hmm. I actually studied software development okay. <laughs> in the beginning of okay. the school. <laughs> And then I got a marketing slash IT position at one of the dealerships in Madrid. And the director slash dealer principal said he saw potential in me. So he um, taught me into the industry. He trained me. So everything I knew stemmed from there. And then after that, I just started doing everything. Oh, wow. <laughs> I, just, I tried like every department in the motor industry. <laughs> So I did finance, I did marketing, I did sales, I did buying in stock, all of that at 19, 20 years old. Right. And people didn't take me seriously in the yep. beginning, hey? Because I was so You still bad. look 19, 20 I years know, old. So. <laughs> they just thought I'm just like the 16 year old coming out of school. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, so they didn't take me seriously, but I worked my way forward. Mm -hmm. um, then after the dealership in Madrid, I moved to a franchise dealer mm -hmm. in Rennfontein. Still living in Centurion, so I did 63 kilometers there, 63 back every day. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, but I didn't stay there for very long. It mm -hmm. didn't work out for me there, didn't feel at home. Then I moved to Subaru, Centurion, and I just found my place. I love the brand, I love the people, I love the industry, so yeah. Okay, and so um, before I even go on to uh, our, the reason we are Women Empowerment, <coughs> let's talk about your job as a product specialist. And the reason I'm asking you this question is because we have many young girls that uh, you know watch this and, and want to enter into the trade. Yes, yeah. just we normally interview FNIs and sales managers, dealer principals, but here's just another opportunity for um, young women at university. Here's another opportunity to do uh, what you'd like to do in terms of marketing or pro being a product specialist. Yeah. I think marketing and, and, and the roles of a product specialist are very similar. So please explain to us just maybe in a nutshell what it is that you do. Okay, so a product specialist <coughs> is your own marketing mm -hmm. and it's it's also sales, it's basically mm -hmm. sales. Yeah. So we are salespeople <laughs> with a fancy title. <laughs> so, um, but also product specialists because... I love that. <laughs> <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> so, 
But a product specialist, we know our products. Yeah. The guys on our Subaru floors, we know our products very mm -hmm. well. We know everything about them. Mm -hmm. And I think that's why it's easier for us to sell it to customers because we are so passionate about it. Mm -hmm. And yeah. Okay, so I like that statement <clears throat> um, that you're just a fancy sales representative. Yeah. Okay, because my husband is actually a product specialist. Okay. I'll take this back to him and say, hello, Mr. Sales Rep. Uh, he's been with his company for 21 years. Okay. And he's a product specialist. <clears throat> <laughs> okay, so what's your opinion about our initiatives as a woman empowerment platform in the motoring trade? I was telling you earlier, it's, it's so, it's awesome. <laughs> it's so <laughs> great to see women, especially in this industry, empowering other women. Mm -hmm. Because you don't get that a lot. And yeah. especially in the motor industry, you it's so scarce yes. to see women yes. out there. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. And why do you think women do well in the sales roles? In, in the sales? <laughs> Maybe I have a job. <laughs> Because no, they, no, do. No. they do, they do, they do. I mean, women in our network, um, in the Motoring uh, Woman of the Year yeah. Awards nominations, in our network that we visit, um, female sales executives, they actually perform way better than, way better. We, I'm not going to say do. way better than who, but they do. Their numbers they are do. high, their numbers are up, they're moving the units, they do well in sales. Yeah. Why? You know, a lot of people tell me this, it's probably just because I'm a girl and I'm pretty or whatever and it annoys me so much because it's not. Send me their way please. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> but we're so dynamic, mm -hmm. you know, we multitask, we have compassion, we actually listen to customers yeah. and their needs. It's yeah. not just a job for us. Yes, yes. It's we, not just a yeah, job. No. It's not just a job for yeah. us. And I think women, we're, yeah. Yeah, that's why. And women are generally very passionate about what they do. And I am. Yeah. And that is why I do so well. It's mm -hmm. Like I said, it's not just a job for me. It's And it's part of your everyday life. Absolutely. I mean, you wake up, you go to work, you spend more time at work than home anyway. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, tell me about uh, a problem that you have solved, um, you know, in a very unique or unusual way in terms of your work. Um, you know, what was the outcome and were you happy and satisfied with it? Were your peers happy and satisfied with it? Again, the reason I'm asking you because there are the people, there are the people that are uh, just starting off in your position. In the industry, and they, yeah. exactly, they need the guidance. Um, one unique situation that happened um, around November, actually. Mm -hmm. So we had this very difficult customer. Mm -hmm very very difficult and nobody could get through to him um the guys that worked trying to assist him the dealer principal tried and nobody you know could get him to purchase the vehicle and i was like okay guys let me try <laughs> you know i went there and one thing about me like when selling a car mm -hmm. i don't sell the car i sell a relationship with yes, the customer absolutely that is one of the big things for me mm -hmm. and with this customer i learned his personality right i learned his needs and his wants so for me it wasn't just to sell him the car mm -hmm. i wanted to build a relationship with him first and get him to trust me mm -hmm. so in the end it actually worked out mm -hmm. and until this day he still pops in the dealership mm -hmm. and says hello and thank Thank and you. that's so precious and right? whatsapps me yes. so yeah no, that's amazing and that's what ensures um or you know yes <coughs> ensures return customers yes relationships yes. long people buy from people i mean Definitely. i know it's so cliched but it's true yeah. people buy from people so who inspires you and why i have three inspirations mm -hmm. <laughs> i have three one my mom uh, hey <laughs> no <laughs> Ah, no, no, no. Sorry, that, that is like 98%. Every, no, it's okay. not. It's actually my uncle. Oh, wow. It's wow. my uncle. He inspires me. I think I'm um, coming from a background and obviously everything wasn't handed to us on a silver platter. You mm -hmm. know, he inspired me to do my best. He always believed in me. To, um, always reminded me to put God first and that worked. Mm -hmm. That is the only reason where I am today, actually. So he encourages my faith a lot. Um, second is my dealer principal. <laughs> okay. 
that let's, let's bribe him here, okay? No, it really is. It really is, actually. His name? Tini Vesta. Okay, so Tini, we, we are definitely <laughs> doing a big shout out to you, yeah. especially because before you continue, we know that you are empowering this beautiful young woman um, and, and we appreciate <coughs> that. So, Thank big you. shout out <laughs> to Tini. Continue. Yeah, he does. He helps me through my deals. Even personally, if there's ever a problem, I go to him. He always inspires me to do better, mm -hmm. encourages me to put a smile on my face oh. and feel better. So yeah. Okay. And the third person is Maxine. Maxine Friends. <laughs> Maxine Friends. That's one of our winners. Okay. <laughs> she also plays a really big role in my role in the industry. She teaches me to be kind and compassionate. Oh. She's so sweet. And even though we're in two different branches, if she needs anything, if I need anything, you just pick up the phone and we help each other no matter, even if the customer is coming to me instead of her or her instead of me, mm -hmm. always there for each other. I mean, you know, just having that backup and that, that support <coughs> yes. is so important, um, especially because um, contrary to what people think, um, that there are a lot of females in the industry, no, they, they, they are not. <laughs> there isn't. There isn't. Um, so yeah, that is so important. So thank you, Maxine. Yeah. So two shouts, shout outs two in shout this out. video. <laughs> um, yeah, especially because Maxine is a champion for yes. for, for women empowerment, she and is. that's I think that's one of the reasons she actually won because she had she mentors so many people, and you guys in turn yeah. in turn has actually voted for her. Yeah. And so you know what? Uh, it's it's I think just paying it forward. Uh, any advice for young girls? Um, that want to join the trade? Just do it. <laughs> it's it's do such it. a, the motor industry is such a dynamic field. You know, it's, it's exciting. It's, and also having not a lot of women mm -hmm. in the field. It's mm -hmm. so nice to see young girls or women in general succeed yes. in the motor industry, you yes. know. And it shows us that we can do it. It's not just a man's world. And mm -hmm. people remind me of that every day. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that I'm just a girl, not even a woman, a girl in a man's world. Yeah. You know, and it's not. Mm -mm. We can definitely do it. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. Paulette. <laughs> for joining us. I wish you all the luck Thank and all the much. best in this journey. It's not about winning. It's about joining our movement to empower, to uplift, to educate, and to just be an inspiration to anyone that might be watching this and uh, might witness your growth in future. So thank you so much. Thank you for having me. You're welcome. <laughs> Viewers, we would like to thank you for your continued support and encourage you to like and share our content. Our non-profit companies, the Motoring Woman of the Year Awards, powered by MFC and Evo by NetBank, and the Talk the Talk Studios, sponsored by Seriti Solutions and Evo by NetBank, are platforms aimed at empowering, uplifting, and celebrating the women of motoring South Africa. We are not just telling stories, we are changing lives. If you are searching for a new or pre-owned vehicle, please visit www.auto.evo.africa. We have a wide range of vehicles on sale for you to choose from. And we only advertise on behalf of reliable and trustworthy MFC accredited dealerships. This car listing portal is user friendly and you can also find vehicle reviews, car maintenance tips and automotive advice all courtesy of Talk the Talk Studios. To end off this amazing interview, I want to add that uh, believe in yourself, have faith in your abilities and ladies becoming successful might look different for all of us, but we all know that it takes time dedication and hard work to reach it. A successful woman um, is she who never gave up on the journey to success. Remember that the question should never be who's going to let me, it should always be who's going to stop me.